Hello, I'm Jeffita. I'm going to build this art car from scratch and do scratch programming to drive this car using keyboard. To build an RC car, these are the components we need. A laptop with scratch programming, QTY building blocks, QTY motherboard, a caster wheel, a battery, two DC motors, two wheels. Using the scratch programming, we will control the DC motors to direction and speed forward, reverse, left and right. Now my RC car is built. Now I will connect the two DC motors in the motherboard. The right motor should be connected in M1 and the left motor should be connected in M2. Let's connect. Now I have finished connecting the two DC motors. Now I would like to run my RC car using the scratch programming. First we will start with the forward action. First we will go to the control. Control palette and then we will take key, press block and place it in the script palette. And then we will go Arduino palette and then we will take two DC motors palette and place it in the scripting palette. And then there are three inputs which we have to fill. First is for the pin, pin number. And the second is for the direction and the third is for the speed. First is for our right motor which is connected in M1. So we will type M1. And then the second one is for direction. A tick mark we will put. Tick mark is for forward and the cross mark is for reverse. We are going forward. That's why we, we have to put tick mark. And then speed we put 125. And second one is connected to left. So the left is connected to M2. So we are going to type M2. And then the direction is tick mark. So it can go forward. And the, the speed is the same. And then we will change it to up arrow. Now that we are done with the forward, forward action, let's go to the reverse action. We will duplicate it now. And then we will change it to down arrow. And then we will put cross and cross mark. And the speed will be same. Again we will duplicate it. And then we will keep it. And then we will give it to right. Which is cross mark and then tick mark. And then the speed should be 50 and 125. And the next one, we will duplicate it again. And then we will change it to left arrow. And then we will put tick mark and then cross mark. And then the speed is 125 and 50.
done, let's duplicate it again. And over there we change it to space. And then over there there should be nothing. And your speed should be zero. Now that we are done, let's check with the RC car whether it's proper or no. Now that all are done, there will be two options in Arduino Plamplet, which is connect Arduino and disconnect Arduino. We will press connect Arduino and we will select, select combo 35 and then it, it will be connected. So it is connected, we can run the RC car now. Forward, backward, right, left, to stop. Please come back and watch my next video. I will make some improvements to the RC car program. Subscribe to Cutipy Official on YouTube and follow Cutipy Robotics on Facebook. Thank you. Bye.